Y'all, we all know that speed kills when it comes to the NBA. If I am building a team, I'm a GM because that's what I do around here. If I was building a team, I need me a point guard with elite level speed. Russell Westbrook, De'Aaron Fox, John Morant, uh, John Wall in his prime. I need an elite, elite amount of speed. So today we're watching videos that, um, that says he's too fast. But I'm going to call it speed kills because I think that's exactly what it does. All right, let's get into it. Starting off with a Russell Westbrook clip. Come on, man. Behind the back, Dan. Get the rookie Nas Reed with a little move. Uh, don't reach. Don't reach because I will teach. Get to the bucket. Right hand over the glass. W. Oh, Ben Simmons. You don't really think about him as a speedy guard, but I mean, you just saw it right there. You just saw it right there. I mean, this dude is about almost seven foot, but he definitely is a speedy guard on top of that. LeBron. 34-year-old LeBron beating people down the court and dunking on people. You, when you take it into perspective his age, bro, plays like this, you're like, wow, how is it even possible? Okay, who is our speed here? DeAndre Benfrey? DeAndre Benfrey turn on the, the wheels? Okay, all right, that's a dub. Giannis, I don't really think about him as speed, but I can I can see it. I can see it. I was definitely expecting more. Um, we're gonna, we have to see some John Morant, right? We have to. Lonnie Walker, that's speed. He had like two seconds to get up court and get that shot up, and he did it. I think that between him and DeJounte Murray, once the once the De'Aaron Fox, not De'Aaron Fox, DeMar DeRozan's contract is up and he's maybe on to his next team, I think the Spurs got a nice young thing going on. I love DeJounte Murray. I think Lonnie Walker has the potential to hit a step, and he's going to be pretty good. Speaking of John Moran, here's the first clip of him. I mean, you got to think about his rookie season. It's an all-time great point guard rookie season. Yes, I said it. It is. This team is projected to win 25 games, and they're in the playoffs at the moment. From his rookie play, and of course, um, them just having a nice, well-rounded core. De'Aaron Fox, we talked about him. He got the nickname of Swiper for a reason. Okay, Kyrie. Oh, my God. Listen, I was live on Twitch yesterday, re-watching Game 7 of the 2016 NBA Finals, and I said it. Uh, Kyrie Irving is the craftiest point guard, craft craftiest player at the rim I have ever seen. And I am not exaggerating. Allen Iverson is probably second. Kyrie Irving is one of the most, he is the most crafty player at the rim, in my opinion, in the history of my eyeballs. You know what I'm saying? In the history of me watching basketball. Ben Simmons got the smaller guard on him. It does not matter because speed kills. You know what we're talking about today. Speed kills. De'Aaron Fox. Open field De'Aaron Fox is ridiculous. It's ridiculous. I mean, he's just, he's just got that burst. He hits that overdrive. The Air Fox is one of those guards that has like five different speed settings. And he can go from number one to number five like that. You know what I'm saying? Just, just shift the gears. LeBron. Nobody's gonna stay. Yeah, nobody's gonna step in front of LeBron. you you gotta be a madman to try to step in front of LeBron on a fast break. Because there's nothing you can really do. You can try to foul him, but he's just too strong for most people to foul and, and then get him not to get the shot up. Oh, Kemba, with three seconds on the clock, he got all the way to the rim. Shot the floater at the buzzer. Mm. It's terrible defense by the Kings right there. Terrible, terrible defense as a team. There's Giannis, full head of steam, Euro step. It just seems so easy when he does it. When you're athletic freak, that stuff happens, but it just seems so easy. Look at Reed. Look at Kyrie. Whew. Like, come on, dog. If I wanted to mold my game around anybody in the NBA, I would want to be like Kyrie Irving. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, I want to be like Kyrie Irving. That boy is electric. He is fun. He is everything you can want. And there's John Wall, prime John Wall. Uh-oh. Kentavious? All right, that's just the, that is just the Timberwolves not giving a damn at the end of the day. Well, there's no reason Kentavious Caldwell Pope should be outplaying you like that. I I'm being honest. Mm. See, I don't even know if that was speed. I think that's just athleticism, strength to go up like that. But here's speed. <sighs> there's speed. Come on, man. It's the skip to my loop. Boop, boop. Quick move. He's 29 years old in that clip, y'all. 29 years old and still got the speed like that. The spin on Alex Lynn. Ugh. Nasty. It's nasty. The spin on Alex Lynn. Oh, Eric Bledsoe. Okay. A little burst of speed there. You see how fast he got through that hole with the little fake handoff? That's nice. That's smart. That's good basketball. Who we had? Oh. Each one? 
eats one. Ooh, I see. That's I want to see a crafty mixtape. That's a crafty play to go between your own legs, go over, and get the on the other side where the defenders are not at. That's a crafty finish right there. Here's some more jaw. Moutier. Who? I remember Moutier was like supposedly the next good point guard, man. Coming out of high school, then he went overseas to play. And, uh, well, that didn't really turn out the way a lot of people expected it to. Oh, that is that is speed, but in a different sense. That's speed in a different sense. Rui, I'm sorry, Rook, but, uh, man, I have this dance. That's what just happened to you. You just got schooled by, by a vet right there. Russell Westbrook with a different color shoes. Late in game, yamming it right on the Denver Nuggets. Is that Devin Harris? Why is Devin Harris playing crunch time minutes? Mm. Dono. Donovan Mitchell. Spin move on Corey Brewer. Shout out to Corey Brewer, man. Here's more John Wall. I miss John Wall, man. I miss John Wall. I cannot wait to see him back on the floor. I got an update on my phone yesterday that said that John Wall says he is 110% healthy. Which, uh, oh, D-Rose. Hold on. This is old D-Rose, too. That's old D-Rose, too. And I was at this game. That was this season. This is old D-Rose. Oh, man, beautiful. Um, John Wall said he's 110% healthy, which is cool. I understand what he's saying, but somebody need to tell this man how percentages work. Because, I mean, hey, shout out to Laurie for jumping. He There's a, like a 6% chance he was going to be able to get that dunk off. Okay, Zach. Okay, Zach. Now, this is a game I was not at um, because it's the Charlotte Hornets and who on the Charlotte Hornets are worth watching. You know what I'm saying? De'Aaron. Mm. That's ridiculous speed. He might have he might have got away with an extra step there, but it is what it is. Russell Westbrook. Don't jump, DJ. You already knew. You already knew not to jump, DJ. Oh, man. Russell Westbrook. James Harden's not known to be fast. Oh, because it's a Russell Westbrook clip. Because the Russell Westbrook clip makes sense. Makes sense. I ain't even got to say it this time around. I ain't even got to say it this time around. I'm not even going to say it this time around. I'm not even going to say it. You know exactly what I want to say, but I'm not going to say it. Uh. But in reality, a lot of people have been tweeting me thinking that I hate the Charlotte Hornets because I don't hate the Charlotte Hornets. It's just no reason for y'all to be on these compilations as much as y'all are. That's all. That's all I'm saying. Sh not okay. All right, now we're getting ahead of ourselves. That's a cr that's a crafty finish. Do not get me wrong, but Shea is not known at all to be fast, and that's why I really like him because he he can plays the game at his own pace. He's not known to be fast at all, but I guess in this very specific play, he just was a little bit faster than the Martin twin. Smarter, craftier. If, if, that's what I would keep saying. That was a crafty finish. Now that is speed. A one-on-three fast break and beating them with a little in and out, that's speed. Because, let's go back, let's go back. You want to know why that's speed? Let me show you how speedy this is. Because the three defenders around him, Trevor Reezy, Trevor Reza is super old. Melo, super old. CJ, not that old. But this just shows the 19, 20-year-old guard just beating up on old men right here. Mm. Just ridiculous. Swoop. Headband jaw. Giannis, that's, now that was a burst of speed from the big fella. And, uh, yeah, people aren't going to do that to the Bulls all day, every day, because they don't play any defense. Here we go. Ben Simmons, just straight to the basket. Just straight to the basket and the dunk. Get out of my way, Kelly Olenek. Sabonis? Okay, I was about to say, this is no way this is a bonus speed clip, right? But no, it's a Dino Mitchell win again. Behind the back, then rap, and that is on uh, Victor Lipo's getting back on defense there. That's one of the best perimeter defenders in the league, but it's not that he can do on a fast break like that. Uh-oh, Gary Harris. Yesterday's video, we did dynamic duos, and some guy tweeted to me, how is it possible for them to have a dynamic duos video without having Jamal Murray and Jokic? And in the time when I was watching that video, I didn't think about it. But he's goddamn right. There's no reason for them two guys not to be on there. They play so well together. With the 5-1 pick and roll and everything, they should have been on there for dynamic duos, but they weren't. But don't come at me. I didn't create the combinations. I just react to them. EB with some just good, some good defense right there, EB. Mini LeBron is what they call him. Mini LeBron is what they call him. The body type is the same.
You know what I mean? Wow. Wow, Swiper. Mm. And that's then that was all for him. It's a turnover. Are we considering that speed? Because that was the slowest zero step I've ever seen. It's just nobody expected it. So what is DeAndre Jordan supposed to do? All right. Oh, Colin Sexton. Colin Sexton. I didn't really think about him going into this. But, yeah, he's a speedy guard. For sure. He's a speedy guard. I did not think about him going into this. But I like that there's a lot of swiper in this, man. Because when I think speed, I think Russell Westbrook, I think Swipe, I think John Wall. Those are the top three guys. And John Morant now, four guys that I think about. And we've got a nice dose of all of those people. Zach Levine with the back door. I mean, we're down by 20 in this clip, but it's always good to see a nice little highlight from Bulls fans. Four Bulls fans. Zach Levine. Mm. We're down in that one, too. Pay attention. Every time we see a Bulls play, just look at the score. And if tell me if they're winning. Colin Sexton. I didn't expect him to get up like that. We're talking about like a 6-1-6-2 guard. Sorry, Ezekes. <laughs> I mean, is, is Kuzma a speedy person? So I don't think about that. I don't think about speed when I think of Kyle Kuzma. Look at the score. Oh, my God. The Bulls are about to have a lead. Look at that. Look at that. The Bulls have a lead. Mm. What a beautiful sight. Luka, not known for his speed either. But he did have a burst right there. Did have a burst right there, but definitely not known for his speed at all. Michael Carter Williams. Who are you gonna get this ball to? Or is this a this is a this is your clip? Okay. Former ROI. I did not expect him to have a highlight. But no, Michael Carter Williams has been pretty good since he signed to Orlando. For what they need. Not that he's a like a top 15 point guard or anything, but for what they need off their bench, he's been pretty solid. Defensively great. Oh, Trey. Ice Trey the gang. You know, you know what's going on, man. Nice pull-up jumper. Somebody was talking to him on the bench. He had to talk back. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Trey Young. DeMar? No. Kawhi? I don't know if that's him being speedy or DeMar DeRose is just not really caring at a certain point. Either way, hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave it a like. We'll be back. Like I said, we're having a 7 for 7 week. And so far, this is day number 4. So we're almost there. We're halfway there. I'll see y'all tomorrow, of course. Peace.